After we picked the Gap, I'd walk past these Gap stores and I'd look at them and I'd think, my God, there's like 2,000 of these stores across the country. Look at all that concrete. Look at the glass. Look at all the staff people. Look at all the clothing. Look at that power. You can still reach these companies. You can still have an effect. I think we have won. We have won small battles in the world. But I think the people are losing the war. In that case, I see... El futuro, el presente y el futuro para nuestros hijos muy oscuro. Pero confío en la capacidad de reflexión, en la capacidad de indignación y en la capacidad de rebelión de la gente. We can change the government. That's the only way we're going to redesign, rethink, reconstitute what capital and property can do. Fifteen corporations would like to control the conditions of our lives. And millions of people are saying, not only do we not need you, we can do it better. We are going to create systems that nourish the earth and nourish human beings. And these are not marginal experiments. They are the mainstay of large numbers of communities across the world. That is where the future lies. You know, I've often thought it's very ironic that I'm able to do all this, and yet what am I on? I'm on networks, I'm distributed by studios that are owned by large corporate entities. Now, why would they put me out there when I am opposed to everything that they stand for? And I spend my time on their dime opposing what they believe in, okay? Well, it's because they don't believe in anything. They put me on there because they know that there's millions of people that want to see my film or watch the TV show, and so they're going to make money. And I've been able to get my stuff out there because I'm driving my truck through this incredible flaw in capitalism, the greed flaw, the thing that says the rich man will sell you the rope to hang himself with if he thinks he can make a buck off it. Well, I'm the rope. I hope. I'm part of the rope. And uh, they also believe that when people watch my stuff or maybe watch this film or whatever, they think that, you know, well, you know what, they'll watch this and they won't do anything, you know, because we've done such a good job of numbing their minds and dumbing them down, uh, you know, they'll never affect it. The people aren't going to leave the couch and go and do something political. They're convinced of that. I'm convinced of the opposite. I'm convinced that a few people are going to leave this movie theater or get up off the couch and go and do something, anything, to get this world back in our hands.